So get smart is step one. Get smart, know what season we're in. We're in winter. In the middle of winter, you can have sunny, beautiful days. It's not like winter's dark and horrible every day, but you gotta know the overall trend so you know how to react. If you try to plant seeds in the winter, I don't care how hard you work, it's not gonna work. Do the right thing, buy a house, do it at the wrong time, 2006 in the US. Doing the right thing at the wrong time, you're gonna get hurt. So number one, get smart, know what season you're in, and decide you're gonna find a way to take advantage of the situation. Number two key, put yourself in a position where you educate yourself. Go find the education, get to our organization, anybody else you want, but educate yourself on not only the season, but how to take advantage of the season. There are all kinds of tools that you can use that when things go down, you do really well. Some of you are familiar with just the use of something simple as ETFs. You need to be educated, you need to know what you're doing, you don't need to do something, if you don't know what you're doing, don't do anything. Just get yourself out and get liquid and get secure and protect yourself. But you gotta understand how to take advantage. Third, get yourself some role models that have done well in a market like this before. And this market's really unique, but there are people like Sir John Templeton. He just recently passed away as a friend of mine. I've studied him over years. He made money during the worst times. His belief was in times of maximum pessimism was when you make the most money. He became a billionaire by making money when the stock markets were crushed, when World War II broke out and everyone was freaking out. He bought stocks so cheap because everybody was giving away that made him a billionaire. He bought stocks in Japan after the war when no one wanted anything in Japan. He went to South America when inflation was exploding. You can do well in very tough times if you're not fearful. If you decide to win, you educate the heck out of yourself, you get yourself a role model, and out of that, get a strategy, get a plan, and get it in action. And finally, measure it. Measure what you're doing, get that coaching, and